just told John them. I don't remember why we decided to walk to Coney Island. I remember that it was November and JFK was dead and Beatles songs were playing everywhere. Maybe we decided to walk to Coney Island because the other girls were prettier. Because our parents worked on Saturdays because she slept on the pull-out couch, because we were the last ones picked for punch ball, because my socks didn't match. I don't remember whose idea it was, but I remember that we marched in step. I don't remember how long it took. I remember seeing the parachute jump and that nothing smelled of cotton candy. I remember a boarded up hotel and that even Nathan's was empty. I don't remember if we ate lunch, but I remember the way Coney Island ignored us like a potential lover who had changed his mind. I remember that I bought a postcard. I don't remember what else we did. But I remember how our disappointment made us irritable with one another and we rode the F train home in silence. I remember that our parents were waiting. I remember the slap across my face and dropping the steeplechase card I had purchased as a gift from my mother. And I remember going home and taking a bath and wondering, why was Coney Island so mean in the winter? And how long would it take to walk there in the spring?